And some news straight from the That's Friggin' Awesome department. Second-year Minnesota Fighting Vikings defensive tackle Jalen Twyman is reportedly ready to rock and roll uh, as the Vikings begin their offseason workout program. And Twyman, of course, missed uh, nearly all of last season after unfortunately getting shot in just a horrific situation uh, last summer. Uh, Chris Thomas and Pioneer Press is where he wrote, uh, Twyman, who, met, who was shot four times last June and missed all of his 2021 rookie season, is expected to begin offseason drills with the Vikings on Monday, a According to his agent, Drew Rosenhaus, Rosenhaus wrote in a text message Saturday that Twyman has fully recovered from his injuries. Twyman, a six-round pick out of Pitt in May 2021, was shot while in a vehicle on June 21st uh, while visiting relatives in his native Washington, D.C. He spent all last season on Minnesota's non-football injury list. And Jalen Twyman was one of the rookies that I was really fired up about. The, I think the Vikings got an absolute steal for him uh, late on day three. And he, even though he, he did drop because of... Of a you know, whatever pro day, uh, he was an absolute monster in 2019. Opted out of 2020 uh, due to COVID, but he posted 36 pressures, 10 and a half sacks, 12 tackles for loss. Just got after it, and he looked to be the next great pit three tech, uh, uh, following in the footsteps of a-, a Ron Donald. Right, so fantastic. And the Vikings, you can never get enough of that quick interior pressure and just the heart and the hustle, just the effort that uh, Twyman gave on every single snap, just getting it, just. And also getting that massive value. Plus, uh, you remember there was a video clip that the Vikings put out where Spielman was calling up Twyman when they took him in the sixth round. And Twyman, he had tears, man, because after that pro day and also taking a year off, no one really knew how that was going to impact a guy like Twyman. And he did fall in in the draft, and the Vikings made his dream come true. And unfortunately, I got off to a rocky start and missed his uh, 2021 rookie season. But now he's back, and I think that he uh, does have a chance to. To be something really special on the Vikings defensive line, even though as of right now, I mean, they're stacked. They're absolutely jacked and stacked, and the Vikings moving to a multiple front where you know there isn't really a three-tech spot in an odd man front, but in terms of getting a, a NASCAR package out there, in terms of four down defensive linemen, maybe kick a couple of defensive ends inside, maybe Twyman's playing that three-tech, you do have a lot of options for a pass rush specialist like Jalen Twyman. So uh, is Jalen Twyman ever going to become a full-time starter in this league? I, I don't know, but I think that he certainly has the ability to get in there as a a platoon pass rusher, a guy who can make a significant impact every single game playing a handful of snaps, who you get in there is like, hey, here's your gap, probably the B gap, go blow it up and go make a play. I think Twyman is that guy, plus just the just the comeback story because he was already a motor heart and hustle guy to begin with and so now you have this where you have this uh, horrific setback and then you're coming back stronger and the fact that you can still get after it I I mean it is so easy to root for a guy like Jalen Twyman like even before uh, the incident but now it's just an amazing story man so I'm rooting like hell for Jalen Twyman I think that he can get in uh, this uh, pass rush rotation and I think that he can get after it so he's a name to watch uh, during the offseason and during OTAs, during mini camp, and especially training camp, and I, I can't wait for preseason because hopefully we'll have a normal preseason this year, and some of these young young guys just really getting it, man. Because I think that Chris Rump, he, I mean, he has work cut out for him replace Andre Patterson, but also he's got so much freaking depth and talent on this team. Because I, I mean, look at this. you got uh, and the interior. You have Phillips, you got Diesel Dalvin, you got Armand for Watts, you got Twyman, you got Julian Taylor coming in from the Niners is a physical freak. Hopefully that ACL is good to go. And you kick James Lynch inside as well. So whew, come on, come on, man. Uh, anyways, uh, your thoughts on our thoughts. Jalen Twyman back, ready to rock and roll year two. Love to see it. Uh, let us know in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support the work? Put a little something in the Venmo. But until next time, Skull. Production value.